the man who pioneered the Indian nuclear research program, Homi Jahangir Baba, was a nuclear physicist who laid the foundation for nuclear research in India. Often hailed as the father of the Indian nuclear program, Baba was not only a scientist but also a visionary and an institution builder. From childhood, he was an intelligent and hard-working student and his parents dreamed of him becoming a mechanical engineer. However, young Baba's interest lay in studying physics and not in becoming an engineer. Yet, he honored his parents' wish and completed his degree in mechanical engineering. His parents too respected their son through interest and supported him in his pursuit of scientific research. Baba studied in Europe where he became acquainted with many great physicists of his time and was determined to contribute to India's scientific research upon his return. He had very ambitious plans and upon returning to his home country, he set about establishing the Cosmic Ray Research Unit. He helped to formulate India's strategy in the field of nuclear power for which he is fondly remembered as the father of Indian nuclear power. The great scientist's brilliant career was cut short by a plane crash which claimed his life. He was born into the home of a well-known Parsi lawyer, Jahangir Baba, and his wife, Meherin. His family was a very wealthy and prominent and he was related to Durabji Tata. After receiving his primary education at Bombay's Cathedral and John Cannon School, he went to Elphine Stone College. Then he studied at the Royal Institute of Science till 1927. His parents and uncle Dorab Tata wanted the brilliant young Homi to study mechanical engineer from Cambridge University so that he could join Tata Steel Mills upon his return to India. Homi went to Cambridge University where he began studying mechanical engineering. But he realized that his true calling wasn't engineering but the pursuit of science. He told his parents of this issue. His father, a considerate person, promised to finance Homi's further studies in science. He completed his mechanical engineering in first class. He passed the mechanical engineering exam in 1930 with first class. Keeping up with his promise, his father let him continue his studies. Homi studied mathematics under Paul Dirac and later worked towards his doctorate in theoretical physics. In 1933, he received his doctorate in nuclear physics and published his first scientific paper, The Observation of Cosmic Radiation, which helped him win the Isaac Newton studentship in 1934, which he held for the next three years. During the 1930s, nuclear physics was an emerging field that often set off hot debates in scientific community. Several breakthroughs were taking place in this field and Homi Baba was deeply drawn to research in this field. During his studentship, he also worked with Neil Bose in Copenhagen along with his research work at Cambridge. He published a paper, Proceedings of the Royal Society Series A in 1935, in which he gave the calculation to determine the cross-section of electron-positron scattering. Along with Neil Bose, he published a paper, The Passage of Fast Electrons and the Theory of Cosmic Showers, in 1936, in which he described how primary cosmic rays from outer space interact with the upper atmosphere. From his work, Baba was awarded the senior studentship in 1937 which helped him continue his work at Cambridge. In 1939, he went to India for a brief vacation when the World War II broke out and this prevented him from returning to Cambridge. He accepted a position in the Indian Institute of Science Bangalore as a reader in the Department of Physics which was then headed by the eminent physicist C. V. Raman. In 1944, 
Baba felt that India needed laboratories and facilities to conduct research in nuclear science. Thus, he decided to solicit the support of visionary and industrialist Durabji Tata. The Tata Trust accepted his proposal and the Tata Institute of Fundamental Research was established in 1945 in Bombay, which had the facilities of conducting large-scale research in physics, chemistry, electronics and mathematics. He also played a key role in the formation of Atomic Energy Commission in 1948 and the Department of Atomic Energy in 1954. A visionary, he had realized the importance of nuclear research program way back in the 1940s when India was still under British rule. He envisioned a three-stage nuclear program consisting of utilization of natural uranium, thorium and plutonium in advanced nuclear reactors with closed full circle. Because of this, he was called the father of India's nuclear power program. In 1954, he was honored with the Padma Bhushan, the third highest civilian award in India, for his invaluable contributions to science and engineering. Homi Baba was a bachelor, a man who fully devoted his life to science. He was also a painter who loved classical music and opera. He aboard the Air India Flight 101, which crashed near Mount Blanc in the Alps on January 24, 1966. He died in that plane crash. Thank you for watching Edupedia World. Please subscribe to watch more videos.